When I started studying with the J-dubs, there were signs that things weren't quite right. But I was young and I didn't have a lot of confidence and I was I was too eager to please in those days. So I, I ignored them and I ignored my instincts. So I found out quite early on, and this was a big sign and I should have listened and, and taken note. So I found out very early on that it was a, a high control group. Now we had two lots of evening meetings and I used to work evenings in different locations and those locations were quite far away from where I lived. It was an hour, hour and a half, two hours to get to, to get to, to my workplace. So I thought, hang on, why don't I go to meetings near where I work? And then I could go straight from the meetings into my job. It seemed great, everyone was, would be happy. So I spoke to an elder um, after a, after a meeting and, and said, oh, do you know of any congregations in X area, in Y area? And he said, well, you, you, should, you should be coming to meetings here. And I explained why. And he said, but then, then we won't know which congregation you belong to. Now, bear in mind that um, these, uh, that your talks and your learning things in each congregation are usually all the same. Everyone gets the same thing told. It's like, like the Mac McDonald's of religion. McDonald's, you go in, you get the same hamburger thing, whatever you want to call it, as everywhere, as everywhere else on the planet. And it is like that with with the J-dubs as well. And there'll be odd local needs talks and things like that. Um, but that that's a small part of it all. So, yeah, I, I, so I was like, oh, I was quite taken aback. And I did adjust my work so I could still go to um, the local meetings and still leave after them for work, which was very meant very very late work actually but i should have i should have stopped shouldn't i i should have stopped and thought well hang on i'll, I'll be attending what's the problem i should have thought but no they wanted to keep their eye on me of course they wanted to know what i was doing why I, where was i was I at this place was I at that was i attending it was all about it's a bit big brother you know we're going to keep our eye on you so I didn't take notice, I didn't listen to my gut. Oh dear, I should have. So that, that's a warning. So I mean, I'm, I'm really trying now to listen to my instincts, but it's a warning for anyone trying anything. Hmm, listen to your instincts. So that's my, my little story on experiencing a high control group. Thanks for listening. Bye.